morning everybody. Welcome to today's vlog. Today is July 6, 2017. It is like 7 o'clock in the morning and everybody's up. My daughter's right there. She's right there. She's up. She's on the computer. My wife's getting, getting ready for work. First things first, I have to go take my wife to work today because Apparently, some, we've, she's had a little bit of issues with her brakes. We got a mechanic come over and fix the brakes for us. This is the, the guy, he's, he's, done my, he's done my car, he's done my daughter's car. He's really a good guy, really, really good. He's a certified mechanic and he doesn't charge us that much. So really, really, are really uh, lucky we have this guy uh, to fix our cars. Because we have only one car payment. We have two cars, but only one car payment. And we want to keep it that way. Because right now, my van is paid for. My, wa my wife's car will be paid for in about a year and a half. My wife's car is paid off. Oh, it's going to be so great when we have nothing. We don't have any car payments. So it's imperative that our cars stay running. It stays in good shape. Because... I don't want another car payment. I'm done paying cars. I'm paying cars my whole life. I want to have no car payment. I want to have two cars and no car payments. I'm going to be a chauffeur for my beautiful wife today, right? Yeah. <laughs> Taking her to work. Dropped off my wife at work over here. That's where my wife works, right over here. Headed back to the to the casa. To chill out some more, get ready for my Friday. Today's my Friday. And then think about the big tournament I'm playing tomorrow. The Planet Hollywood 200. It's probably going to be another one of those standalone uh, vlogs where I just do that all day long. So I'm pretty, pretty excited about it. Rereading a lot of the terror books that I have, you know, pick up some different philosophies and just. Um, getting my mind back in the tournament mode. So I'm pretty, pretty excited because it'll be my first tournament, my, my first and probably only tournament during the World Series. And we'll see how I do. But first, I gotta be Mr. Poker Dealer Guy for one more day. Last pretty much hour before heading to work reading this poker book. This is like, it's called The Course by Ed Miller. Here it is right here. This is like one of the best poker books I think I've ever read. Um, a lot of the ideas there are still fundamental. They're not really like advanced as they say, but the concepts are like really simple. It really is. It makes sense. It's like one of those, uh, aha, that makes perfect sense. And reading it, you know, it's, it's an easy read. It tells you pretty much straight up what you got to do, A, B, C, D, E, whatever. If you apply these principles in no limits, you should be able to win in the long run. And I'm really excited about trying to apply some of these new ideas into my No Limit game. There was a couple of sections there where I was like, ah, I get it now. I totally get it. So next time I go play a cash game, I'm going to be playing pretty much how this book tells me. And hopefully I'll get the desired results that I can because they do make sense. Everything in this book makes perfect sense. It's like, it's like um, common sense. It's like, okay. That shouldn't be hard to remember. That shouldn't be hard to do. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited about trying it out. And won't be doing this weekend, maybe, because uh, I'm playing a tournament. Maybe I'll play a cash game later on this this, this weekend. But right now, um, I can't wait to get back to playing more cash games on my free time. Whenever I have free time. <laughs> Anyways, time for work. It's Thursday, my Friday. Try to get, try, try to get through the day. And come home and enjoy my weekend because I'm pretty excited about the weekend. It's going to be a poker, poker kind of weekend. Oh, yeah. It's another beautiful day here in Vegas. Ah, one more day being Mr. Poker Dealer Guy for the week. And then it's going to be playing lots of poker this week. And weekend. <laughs> Got my trusty... Uh, nuts here I got from the Philippines. Check this out. Adobo cracker nuts. Got it's from the Philippines. This is really, really good stuff. That's my snack for the day. Try eat, still trying to eat healthy. Nuts, I guess, is good. 
little coconut, sweet peanuts action. Yeah. So the basic case scenario just happened today. I actually only work five hours. I'm off. It's like five o'clock. So I only work five hours. My pretty much dealt the whole way, so I made some pretty decent money today considering I only work five hours. So oh, happy, happy that I got to go home because I'm, I think I'm still a little worn out from that 11 hour shift on Monday. I think I'm still feeling the effects of it. So, but I'm happy. I'm gonna go home and get into weekend mode. A tournament tomorrow, like I said. I'm pretty excited about playing in it. Sign of Hollywood, 200 all buy-in. I'm gonna be hyped up tomorrow. I'm thinking about it now, so. Oh, should be a good day, but tonight, it's all about relaxing. I may play some online poker, but generally speaking, I'm probably just gonna relax. It is my Friday. I'm off tomorrow. It's all good. Stop by this place for dinner because that's what everybody wants. Can you see where I'm at here? What do I say? And here it is, guys. Look at that. When in doubt, in and out. Those guys in the East Coast that don't know what this is, this is one of the most popular burger joints in the West West Coast. People from the East come to the West Coast. The people that live in the East that come to the West always look for this place, in and out It is good. And we have it all over Vegas. Now I'm just chillaxing here at home, playing a little online poker, and then I'm gonna read uh, read some read actually my favorite tournament book. This is uh, the Razor's Edge It's by Elki Graspierre. He's a very very popular very very good tournament player I think he finished second in the one drop in the 2017 World Series So I pretty much do do what he says pretty much so there's a couple sections here I really really like so I'm gonna go reread some of the stuff and uh, Get, get myself mentally prepared to play this tournament tomorrow. So, so it's going to be a uh, poker kind of night for your boy Ronnie Bizzle on his Friday. Just chillaxing. So I'm over here to play online poker. And I'm already down to buy in. <laughs> oh boy, I'm, I'm down to buy in right away. So I'm, I'm the first I can buy in. Anyways, I am reading a little bit of this book before I start editing the vlog. And. Those of you who play poker, turn poker, this is like one of the, uh, this is like, it's like, it's like, um, higher level stuff, like the stuff, the concepts of this book. It's pretty much, it's built on aggression. I mean, pretty much the uh, theme of this book is you have to be aggressive, but smart. Smart, aggressive will win you the uh, chips. You can't be afraid to bust out. You cannot be afraid. And, um, a couple of things, a couple of the concepts that I'm, um, looking at right now, um, I'm definitely um, remember reading it when I first got the book, and so I'm gonna apply a lot of these principles tomorrow and see how I do. So, if I play exactly the way this guy plays, I'm either gonna be knocked out very very early in the tournament, or I'm gonna, or I'm gonna have a lot of chips. There's no pretty, there's no in between in this uh, thing. So, you know. Oh, I think I got a flush. I think I'm going to lose here. Oh, I lose. I have a flush and I lose. <laughs> I lose again. Oh, this cash game is not, not, not going well for me right now. Anyways, um, yeah, so anyways, um, I'm just, I'm going to apply a lot of the stuff in here. Like I said, I'm going to have either a lot of chips or I'm going to be bust out early. I'm going to play aggressive. That's, I'm going to try to, I'm going to try, I'm going to try to play to, uh, win the tournament, not, uh, mid cash. So, Anyways, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here because so after I edit the vlog, I'm gonna probably play a little more and then probably go to bed a little early because the tournament uh, the tournament is at um, at 11 o'clock. So I want to get there kind of early, eat some breakfast, and uh, get myself meant to prepare for this tournament. So, anyways, that's it for today. If you like this video, please comment, like, and subscribe. Please share it with your friends. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Ronnie Bizzle TV. Ooh, let's do it.